Automation in ring vending machine is done to save time in this very busy life. Hello everyone, my name is Ibra Hussain. I am pursuing my graduation in Electrical Engineering from Zakir Hussain College of Engineering and Technology, AMU. Today I am here to demonstrate my project on automation of ring vending machine. This project is sponsored by Ministry of Human Resource Development, Government of India under TechWip 2, NPIU and the World Bank. The demonstration will consist of the real problem description, then I would take up the automation concept, PLC programming, visualization in HMI and finally I would explain the further step of this project. First I would take up the real world problem description. Manually making and serving drink is a very time taking process. A lot of labor is required and therefore it is expensive too. So automation of drink vending machine is done because it provides the drink instantly. Now this figure shows the automation concept. The control of machine is done by switches. We can select tea, sugar, coffee and milk from the buttons present on the machine. All these hardware are interfaced to the PLC. The operation monitoring can be done by the HMI or the SCADA system. Now let's see how this all is achieved in programming. The first step involves writing the program, testing it and downloading it to the PLC. The second step involves creating the screen and monitoring the operation by downloading it to the HMI. Now let's see each one of it separately. This is the Siemens TIA software. We have selected the PLC S7300 with the CPU 314C2 PNDP which has multiple interfaces that is Ethernet, Profinet and Profibus interface. Here we have used the Profinet interface. Here are the PLC texts that we have used to assign input, output and memory state systematically. The program is written in the main block. The program is divided into 17 different networks where all the conditions are systematically dealt with. For example, first we insert the coin, then we'll have to select sugar, then milk, coffee and so on. Now the from here we can download the program to, to the PLC. Next we see how HMI screen is created. The HMI screen is made in Siemens WinCC flexible software. A suitable device has been selected that is TP177B. Now in this project I have three screens. The start screen contains the project information. Here is the next screen that is the welcome screen where the coin has to be inserted to enter the main screen. The main screen contains all the buttons like sugar, milk, coffee, tea, remove cup button. Here also we have assigned the tags. The connection is done with the PLC and the acquisition cycle is kept as one second. From here we can download the program to the HMI. Now let's see the program simulation. This you can see is the start screen. We press here and move on to our next screen. Now we will insert the coin. Now as you can see the coin is getting inserted. We can enter the main screen by pressing the enter button. Here as you can see there are various buttons for selecting sugar, milk, coffee and tea. And also here is remove cup button. Now we will select them one by one. As you can see, when the either of the drink is selected, the cup level is a start, the cup level is rising. Now the cup is filled completely. Now we can remove the cup and reset the machine. Now our machine is ready for the next cycle. This was the visual demonstration of the project. However, there is always room for improvement. So the further steps that can be included in this project can be indication of level of sugar and milk and also the selection of amount of sugar and milk required for the drink. 
So we come to an end of our demonstration. I would like to thank our Department of Electrical Engineering, Zakir Hussain College of Engineering and Technology, AMU, for providing all the facilities. A very special thanks to ZMS Technology for making us understand and learn the concept of automation. I also appreciate the support and help extended by the staff, co-trainers and my friend. Thank you all.